Some insects, among them butterflies, have developed a way of growing that involves a truly astonishing transformation. This is a heliconius butterfly, and this is its offspring, a caterpillar. The two look as though they're completely different creatures, but of course, they're not. The butterfly has divided its life into two halves. The first half, the caterpillar, is devoted almost exclusively to gathering food and growing. And the second, the adult, is devoted almost entirely to reproduction. Adult butterflies feed on nectar, which they locate with their antennae, taste through their feet, and collect with long, tube-like mouthparts. This sugar-rich food fuels their search for a mate. Once a male and female have found one another, the male uses special claspers at the end of his abdomen to transfer his sperm to her. Once fertilized, the female Heliconius lays her eggs on the leaves of the passion flower plant. Her young, the caterpillars, are fussy eaters, and these leaves are almost the only ones they will eat. She lays around 50 eggs, and then her work is done. About a week later, the caterpillars emerge. They are little more than eating machines, and they get down to work immediately. Some, over a month or two, can grow to 40 times their original size. They have protective spines to ward off their predators, but no reproductive organs. Then, when they've grown enough, their behavior changes. They stop eating and settle in a suitable resting place. Then their skin hardens to form a shell. This is a chrysalis. If we could see inside, we would witness one of the most extraordinary changes in the animal kingdom. Metamorphosis. Some parts of the caterpillar are transformed and others disappear completely. The caterpillar had a massive gut for processing food. That shrinks, for nectar will be easier to digest than the leaves the caterpillar consumed. The mouth parts must change. The adult needs not munching jaws, but a tube-like tongue. The caterpillar's simple eyes are also transformed. Searching for a mate needs better eyesight than finding leaves. Antennae sprout from its head. It will use them to sniff out the scent of a female or a flower. And finally, its wings. Their shape and color will warn off predators and enable it to find and select a suitable mate. An adult Heliconius butterfly emerges after eight days of transformation.
Its delicate wings are crumpled and wet. It stretches them by pumping blood along their veins and then waits for them to dry before attempting to fly. From this point on, its body will not grow or change. It will live for just a month or two and feed just enough to keep itself going. This body is purely for mating. A male's antennae can detect female scent from more than a kilometer away. And he's off to find a female.